Hey, do you have a charger? My tablet just died. Sure. Here you go. Oh, thanks. Man, I hate when we lose power to our tablets. Me too. Have you ever thought about how we use power for everything? Yeah, we do use power for everything, don't we? Where exactly does power come from? I don't know. Let's find out. There are millions of hot jobs in the energy industry, from biologists who look out for the environment to engineers who use solar technology to harness the power of the sun. Let's meet some of the industry experts at Dominion Energy, where 18,000 employees produce and deliver clean energy you use every day. My name is Armand Sakrani. Um, I'm a project engineer here for Dominion Energy for four solar farms. On a typical week, I'm out here on the field, so I typically look at the reports and all the procedures that take place in order to accomplish that. Renewable energy provides a multitude of opportunities, so we have the civil portion, the environmental portion, the electrical portion, and it all kind of comes together. Coming from a small island in the Caribbean, the island of St. Martin, I didn't have much of the resources that you know others do. If you ever had a passion for you know doing something that positively impacts the environment and want to learn different aspects of engineering, of all different types of engineering, um, I definitely grasp the opportunity if, if possible. My name is Noelle Young and I am a Dominion Energy groundman. As a groundman, you are sent to two weeks of groundman school where you pretty much get a jump start, hands-on, learning to just kind of learn the basics of the job. After you go to groundman school, you get to start out in the field and that's where we really learn everything. So mentoring and coaching our peers is a vital aspect of our jobs. We play more of a support role. We build material for the linemen and we do pretty much everything on the ground to keep the operation running. You know, we'll talk to the customers, we'll stop traffic, hand stuff up to the linemen, um, and pretty much do anything else to keep the job running from the ground level so that the linemen only have to worry about what's up in the air. Uh, my name is Danny Bryant. I'm a biologist. When I was a little fishing on the bay with my dad, so of course I always had that inclination to be on the water. My favorite task is when we go out and do our fish surveys. So we'll go out in very remote areas into streams. We'll do backpack electrofishing, do fish transfers uh, where we collect the fish, move it to other areas to reestablish indigenous populations in an area. In high school, the science classes were some of my favorite, the most interesting to me. And then as I went to college, as you get further along, you start to take the more specialized classes. And that's what I found the most interesting because you can really fine tune um, what you want to learn about, what you want to see, and where you want to go. We have to keep the surrounding environments as healthy as we can uh, with as little impact as possible. And so that's nice about this job is we're able to get out we're doing the testing, we're seeing what's going on out there firsthand. So when we're getting this information, we're passing it out to um, our higher ups, we're giving it to government agencies, we're giving it to uh, different schools are using some of the data that we get. So the information is definitely valuable. That's pretty cool. Biology is my favorite class. I haven't thought about doing that as a job. <laughs> you know, I could totally see myself working in the renewable energy field someday. <laughs> Speaking of biology, you can get this after class.